We thought our best telescopes had mapped the universe's limits. But in just 255 hours, the James Webb Space Telescope shattered every expectation, revealing nearly 780,000 galaxies crowded into a patch of sky three times the size of the full moon, ten times more than any theory could explain. Then came the bigger shock. Webb's new measurements show the universe expanding 8% faster than physics allows, verified by teams from Johns Hopkins to Europe, forcing some of the world's top scientists to admit something fundamental is missing from our model of reality. The question now isn't just how massive the universe really is, it's how much of what we thought we knew was wrong. In a single sweep, the James Webb Space Telescope mapped a region of sky three times larger than the full moon, capturing the light of 780,000 galaxies. Each one, a city of stars, spread across 98% of cosmic history, stretching back more than 13 billion years. The Cosmos Webb Survey, led by Jolene Carlberg and Caitlin Casey, gathered this panorama over 255 hours of continuous observation its detectors tuned to the faintest whispers of ancient starlight. The result is not just a photograph, but a census of the universe on a scale never attempted before. Within this mosaic, galaxies crowd every corner. Some are so distant, their light began its journey when the universe was only a few hundred million years old. Others cluster together in tangled webs, forming the vast filaments and voids that define the universe's structure. What stands out is not just the sheer number, but the unexpected density. The survey revealed ten times more early galaxies than any model had predicted. Theorists expected the infant cosmos to be sparse, with only a handful of pioneers shining through the dark. Instead, Webb's data shows a sky overflowing with mature galaxies, some massive, some small, but all existing far earlier than theory allows. For astronomers, the numbers are staggering. The image compresses billions of years into a single frame, forcing a reckoning with the speed and scale of galaxy formation. Theories built over decades now face a challenge. How could so many galaxies, so complex and so soon, have assembled out of primordial chaos. The Cosmos Web panorama doesn't just expand our map of the universe, it calls into question the very rules that shaped it. On December 8, 2024, astronomers released the results of the largest expansion rate study ever undertaken. The James Webb Space Telescope, working alongside teams from Johns Hopkins and collaborators around the globe, delivered a figure that sent ripples through the scientific community. The universe is expanding at 73 kilometers per second per megaparsec. This isn't just a minor adjustment. It stands nearly 8% faster than the expansion rate calculated from the afterglow of the Big Bang, where the Planck satellite and the cosmic microwave background set the value at just 67 to 68 kilometers per second per megaparsec. For over a decade, this conflict, known as the Hubble Tension, has haunted cosmology. Some argued it was a mirage, the result of hidden flaws in how telescopes just measured the distances to nearby galaxies. Others blamed the stars themselves, or the dust that clouds their light. But JWST's infrared vision, sharp enough to pick out individual Cepheid variables in crowded galactic neighborhoods, stripped away those doubts. Its measurements, cross-checked by multiple international teams, matched Hubble's results down to the decimal point. Nobel laureate Adam Rees, leader of the SH0ES collaboration at Johns Hopkins, called the finding inescapable. With two NASA flagship telescopes now confirming each other's findings, we must take this problem very seriously. It's a challenge, but also an incredible opportunity to learn more about our universe. The numbers leave little room for error. Systematic uncertainties, blending, metallicity, dust, have been dissected and minimized. Even alternative distance ladders, 
using red giant stars and carbon-rich giants, tell the same story. What remains is a universe that refuses to fit the standard model. Either there are missing ingredients, unknown forms of energy, particles, or forces, or our understanding of cosmic history needs a fundamental rewrite. The expansion rate crisis has shifted from a technical puzzle to a direct challenge, one that demands new physics to explain how the cosmos grows. Across the depths of the cosmos web mosaic, one galaxy stands apart from the rest. A system cataloged as GSNDG9422, lying 13.3 billion light years away. Its light began traveling toward us when the universe was just a billion years old. Yet, what Webb found inside this faint smudge defies every expectation. The stars in GSNDG9422 burn at temperatures close to 80,000 degrees Celsius, hotter by far than any star known to exist today. For decades, theory held that even the most massive, metal-poor stars could not exceed 50,000 degrees. Here, those limits do not apply. Dr. Alex Cameron and her team at the University of Oxford led the analysis. Using JWST's Anir Spec spectrograph, they measured the galaxy's light, dissecting its spectrum line by line. The results were so extreme that the team ran their calculations three times, searching for a mistake. Instead, the data held firm. Emission lines from hydrogen, helium, and oxygen painted a picture of a galaxy in the throes of a starburst, with gas so energized that it outshines the stars themselves, a phenomenon almost unheard of in cosmic history. The European Space Agency independently reviewed the findings, confirming the impossible temperatures and the dominance of nebular emission. The chemical fingerprints in the light reveal a mix of elements, evidence that this is not a pristine first-generation galaxy, but one already enriched by earlier cycles of star formation. Yet nothing in current models explains how such a system could assemble so quickly, or how its stars could reach such blistering heat. Dr. Cameron described the discovery as completely unexpected and currently completely unexplainable. Theories of star formation, built on decades of observation and simulation, cannot account for the energy pouring out of GSNDG9422. In this corner of the young universe, the rules appear to have changed. Here is concrete proof that the cosmos is stranger and more extreme than anyone had dared to predict. Scattered among the galaxies of Cosmos Web, astronomers have flagged a pattern that refuses to fit any known cosmic script. Thirty-five objects, each a compact red dot, sit at distances so extreme, over 11 billion light-years, that their very existence challenges the timeline of cosmic evolution. The most striking, called the cliff, lies 11.9 billion light-years away, and displays a sharp ultraviolet spike known as the Balmer Break, a feature typically reserved for much older, more developed galaxies. Yet, these dots burn with energy and density that standard models say should be impossible in the early universe. At the Max Planck Institute, teams pored over the data, debating whether these signatures could be explained by errors, exotic stars, or something entirely new. Some hypothesize these are black hole stars, objects theorized but never before observed, where the core collapses into a black hole while still wrapped in a shroud of burning hydrogen. Others suggest the red dots might hint at a missing chapter in the story of galaxy formation, one that defies every simulation to date. Access to the raw observations, however, remains tightly controlled. NASA's 12-month proprietary period means that only select science teams can study the full details of these discoveries. Even after embargoes lift, layers of technical jargon and complex data pipelines keep independent verification out of reach for most. 
the JWST mission director must hold top secret slash SCI clearance, not for the science itself, but because of the sensitive hardware and materials on board, protected under strict U.S. export controls. Some findings, especially those with potential military or technological implications, remain behind locked doors for years. The result is a growing tension between the promise of open discovery and the reality of institutional barriers. As new classes of cosmic objects flicker into view, the question lingers. How much of the universe's true story remains hidden, not by distance or time, but by the limits of access and the walls of secrecy? In 2025, the James Webb Space Telescope captured 780,000 galaxies in a single panoramic image, covering 98% of the universe's known history. Its results confirm the universe is expanding 8% faster than established models predict, a finding verified by multiple international teams. Yet, discoveries like the 80,000-degree stars in GSNDG 9422 galaxies more massive than theory allows, and 35 unexplained red dot objects challenge our most fundamental assumptions. Despite independent verification from groups like the European Space Agency and Max Planck Institute, much data remains locked behind 12-month embargoes and classified access. NASA's top-level security restrictions and recent budget threats further limit public analysis. Today, evidence shows the universe is not only larger, but stranger than standard cosmology can explain. As research teams struggle against institutional barriers, one fact is clear. The true scale and nature of the cosmos remain beyond our current understanding, and Webb's discoveries have only deepened the mystery.